Hello everybody, Luke the Folk here, welcome back to some more Bioshock 2. I knew you said Dead by Daylight for a second, I'd be like, whoa, different game here. This is not Dead by Daylight, this is Bioshock. But, you know, I'm glad I didn't say Dead by Daylight first, so nevertheless, I got Dead by Daylight on the brain at the moment, but, you know, I've just recently am uploading a Dead by Daylight Survivor video, so... Uh, I don't know when that will get uploaded, or probably at some point later today, or later tonight, or whenever it decides to upload. Um, it's a pretty good um, video. Oh, well, I would say anyway, you know, good three games. Well, two games, I would say. The last one was pretty much of a, eh, you know, situation, and meh, you know, dealing with a salty killer, you know, and obviously, you know, random tactics, you know, targeting and someone only it's like uh oh, they never learn will they but with that being said let's get right right into Bioshock 2 I'm afraid the lights in here sting my eyes terribly now. Until you arrive to deal with me, they will remain off. Please, locate the breakers and flip them, and then return here to restore power. Sophia and I knew that to create the first true utopian would come at a high cost, my friend. We needed someone to be host to all that Adam, Rapture's finest minds. A willing subject, that is to say, myself. There we go. Now what? Whatever you may have seen inside the tank, that was indeed me. I fear the fate of Eleanor Lamb will be less physical, but no less grotesque. This tank for deep sea life is the ideal way to dispose of me. But first, you must retrieve enough adam-infused plant life to lure me out. The slugs feed on the stuff, and it's all I seem to want now. I have left a sample here, so you know what to look for. Mm 
I don't really want to sit in the big chair. Oh! Listen, son, those override keys you've been hunting are genetically encoded. And to get to Eleanor, you're gonna need one from Alex the Great in there. First things first, we gotta pin him down, find those plants he mentioned, and lure him back out. Have you running around the laboratories in your condition? I can't see a thing. around playing daddy until some splicer manages to kill off their sister and then if the coma doesn't take them they turn maniac nothing left to do but scream uh, no offense intended son we better get you to Eleanor on the double your body begins to tear itself apart the compulsion to find Eleanor will drive you to madness or coma you have no claim on her. Your design was among Rapture's greatest sins. And yet, you persist. Why? Amazing. 
What's attacking me? Take it, I'll go through that. Oh, that oh, 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 oh. Alright. Might as well save it, just in case. I have a right existing save, yes. Because, why not? I wasn't even going to attack her. Um. Um.
his will to die, Delta. To serve the majority by protecting them from his lunacy. Your entire journey here is based on your refusal to do the same. Will you grant his request, knowing that he served the family? Rebirth, huh? Sure, you live forever, but minus your body. I like my body, kid. I don't feature the idea of my memories and personality being stored in the head of some saintly child, like just one more dusty old book in the library. Delta. She was to be an heir to my life's work. And this is where they changed her, bonding her to you. The child she was died in this room. All right, sport, time to feed the fish. Head on back to Alexander's tank and put those plants in.
attachments. All right. Once again, saving it just in case it's a boss fight. I'm not doing that all over again. System online. Notice to all employees, Subject Delta is hereby dismissed. Escort them from the premises! No. With this, this bribe, this penance, this sublime. God damn you, Delta! Ah, <laughs> perfect, son. You reeled him in. Now use that console there to take a gene sample. It should print up a genetic key automatically. You got the key to Lamb's hideout, Sport. Eleanor's down there. Now just head out to the Oxyfill station and use it. It is done. The sample disposal button on the panel in front of you will administer a massive jolt of electricity to the tank. More than enough to kill me. Whatever I may say to dissuade you, do not listen. The man whose voice you hear now is long gone. As my mind fades, I find my thoughts turn to the suffering that Eleanor will be made to endure, and I am overcome with pity. But I can only offer my feeble prayers. Perhaps after my death, you can do more. Now, please, I ask you to grant me peace. Goodbye, my friend, and thank you. You, you don't have to kill me, Delta. I'm sorry. Oh, please. I will go outside. I will live outside.
And it fades to black. Son, and fast. Her mama's got all rapture, dying to keep you two apart. All right, so. That's not good. I wonder, Delta, do you know why you are here? Have you any idea what my daughter has given you? As I watch you now, I envy your ignorance. That's her son, Eleanor Lamb. No matter what you might be feeling right now, this is business. Get that cage open. She's coming with us. my pieces on the board as expected as have you is this what she hoped for mother and father locking eyes yet still we are blind goodbye subject Delta and take heart for you at least have escaped your legacy oh that's not good oh that's
Yeah, I'm done. Three big sisters all at once. I'm dead again. Chambers waiting on you. Get in there. Your Look at her, Delta. Ten years, and still she dreams of you. Fifty seconds remaining. Do you know why Eleanor brought you here? She wanted a father, so she found a way to restore you in body and mind. And she has been watching you ever since, exalting your every act as gospel. girl lying on that bed is no longer my child, nor my life's work. She is a monster, shaped by you alone, just as she has always wanted. 20 seconds remaining. But there is one detail of your mutual bond she failed to account for. Your body was designed to lapse into a coma when her heart ceases to beat. Eleanor, forgive me. Damn. His body is shutting down now, naturally. But if he dies of trauma, he will return elsewhere. Full restraints at all times. No one enters this room until he expires.
Father, it's me, Eleanor. I'm so sorry. Mother stopped my heart long enough to sever our bond. Staying near me won't stop you from dying now, or worse. But I can still help you escape. This little sister's brought you something that will allow you to take control of her. Damn. I know this feels a bit strange, Father, but now you can see through her eyes and tell her where to go. This is how I brought you back without Mother catching on. Now, first, let's get you out of here. And... Can I save it? I can't save it for some reason. She's holding us in. Find a way to slip in there. Yeah, I can't save it for some reason. So, I am going to leave it there for now. I hope that you have enjoyed uh, this video anyway. But nevertheless, we found Eleanor and all of a sudden... Yeah, things took a turn for the worse, shall we say. So, um, now we get to control the little sister. Awesome. Thumbs up all around, I would say. And nevertheless, I hope that you are enjoying your weekend so far. And also, yeah, looking forward to the, yeah, the rest of the week. And looking forward to Sunday. I'm pretty sure you're enjoying your rest of your afternoon or morning, wherever this video decides to load. But, nevertheless, with that being said, and that was a lot of fun. Yeah, it was a little bit challenging. Yeah, going up against three um, sisters all at once. But I did it. So, even though I died, what, like twice? I think it was twice. So, yeah. But, nevertheless, it was a little bit difficult. I will say that. So, um, But, with that being said, uh, if you want more Bioshock 2, please leave a like, share, and subscribe. And until the next time, everyone... I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye for now.